a little too late but oh what I, I i wanna give it a chance i think i've like i kind of like like tabang but even though we had talked about not being together ever in the house yeah we started to talk about like being together outside of the house which was never really a thing hello wonderful people welcome once again to this channel subscribe and turn on bell so wonderful people, this is Kiosi's diary section yesterday with Big Brother and she is trying to tell Big Brother about a circle, like the circle she is between Tamba and Yemi and she feel like um, Yemi uh, giving her love is too late for her that initially she wanted Yemi but because of the doings of Yemi that she's no longer interested that she is being confused but to be specific she said um she prefers tabang than yemi though yemi spoke about both having something after the show but i am very certain that both of them two are not certain with their choices so imagine kiosi saying that uh, she's having soft uh, feelings for tabang like not even this one self so yesterday she sent uh valentine's uh, message to the boyfriend that to say that this girl self is not very certain with our uh, our own choice and also like there's something we do not understand about kiosi honestly speaking let's assume this show was to be a uh, niger program that this is what niger people detest but then i am seeing people appreciating our doing appreciating our cheating and lies habits mm. Can you imagine after making Yemi to fall for you, after making Yemi to abandon Blue, now you're having soft feelings for Tabang. Things are not done like that. At least she must be specific. I am seeing people badging at Yemi. Yemi is this and that. But people are not talking about what Kiyosi is doing. This is very uncalled for. And I am very pissed with our Nigerian people because we, we are not straightforward in dealings. So put your own. This girl is she knows what she's doing at the end of everything she will not end up with yemi all these shows she's making people to dislike yemi it's making people to look down at yemi's character it's making people to make sure that they batch at him anyhow and it's not done why can't people also see what this girl is doing like okay you have made this person to change his mind for you now you want to turn your back at the person who does that who does that how all those things people are now blaming um Ebuka because of the life this thing he did the question he asked yemi people were like why would Ebuka expose this uh yemi like that 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 is own strategy why would such thing happen that even prompted one of the fans to even lay courses on Ebuka, which Ebuka's wife too came out to you know to intervene to you know I don't wipe something now so the lady swore for the person that sent the message to Ebuka, which i'm going to be reading it now for you people so take a look at this this is what this person says i now pray every day against Ebuka. Ebuka will never know peace until he undo what he has done against yemi Kress. so Ebuka's wife being cynthia says you and your entire generation will never know peace in jesus name amen the audacity for you guys to constantly harass someone to do something you know then when it's done and the result does not go the way you expect you result to sending death straight the ridiculousness of you lot to be so vile and toxic over a bloody entertainment show even the people who you think should have sense spend their whole day here tweeting vile things about human beings for fuck's sake wash and laugh and move on which one is wash and laugh and move on i beg go to me i never liked i never fancy what ebuka did but then he's also doing his job but then if you really want to expose Start from the genesis, also showcase the conversation, ask questions about QC, the conversation she has been having with Yemi, telling Yemi that she does not want something serious with him, that she wants ordinary housemate friendship, not even serious relationship, not serious friendship. 
reason being that she has someone outside the house and she does not want to let go of her relationship which she has also discussed that with ganaga so you now coming to cut yemi short making him look like uh like it's not there for a game it's so alarming and i, ne I never fancy that but for this person too to have sworn for epoca i do not I like i do not like it too but imagine someone like okay who causes this thing kihosi you understand now yesterday you sat down you sent valentine message to your boyfriend but none of the nigerian people are badging at her people are praising her people are saying oh girl move on but why can't we see uh, Nigerians we Momo? I have checked most of the comment sections. I have gone through it. I have not seen any South African people uh, supporting Nigerian housemates. Instead, they are the one even dropping more of the negative comments about Nigerians. And we now, uh, we Momo, shortly, uh, they stand by them. Like, it, look, this kind of thing not too good. I beg, may we change vote your people whether they are bad whether they are good use the eye where una they take the look on mama food even though your mama they cook nonsense food give una una go see appreciate and say hey my mama food might be the best make una use that same eye look at our nigerian people please do not use your hard earned money to vote south african people low now that we are having um uh scarcity of uh, cash inflow in nigeria be wise you understand so i'm going to let you guys listen to the message kihosi sends to the boyfriend i always start with my official boyfriend in my life because i ever since i've been in the house um i really hope he's gonna see this but i do want to say i don't know how you feel <laughs> and how kind you are on Sunday, honestly, Ebuka must ask this girl thorough questions about her relationship with her official boyfriend. Imagine she sending Valentine messages to the guy and people are praising her. Like, I'm not getting it. At the same time, you guys want Yemi to love her. You guys want Yemi to stick to her. You guys want Yemi to be with her. It is not done like that. We should stop it. <laughs> My Nigerian people, please let's be wise we shouldn't be carried away with trending words honestly words like oh people do not like kiosi i don't know why people like putting kiosi on a, a, a nomination i don't know why people are always nominating a, a kiosi kiosi is nominating people kiosi is talking down at people kiosi is doing those things people are doing to her to people so why all this so before then let's also take a look at blue and black these people are getting along so fast and i like this thing i'm seeing honestly i so much appreciate the both of them guys wow blue black finally kissed yesterday like guys i am so thrilled though finally they are getting along ooh, ooh. um so wonderful people that yesterday yemi was looking for a way to hug blue like oh like you guys you need to see how he was zooming around to and fro like oh more finally you can spot him hugging blue and they were so happy together honestly <laughs> <laughs> My guy. So wonderful people, naturally, it is not good for one to force relationship. Of it, Do not you force can someone never to never enjoy the relationship end. if you're forcing someone into it. So you can see blue and yemi now like nothing to drag nothing to you know the connection is just there naturally that's why you always see yemi going to meet Blue. so both of them have real connection there's nothing to drag about there's nothing to drag over you can see it by your own self so wonderful people thank you for listening it's me clara subscribe thank you and i'm coming back again